that time. It's time to cross that bridge, right? Actually, the fourth dimensional bridge no longer exists. But have you made your choice? Are you 3D or are you 5D? Have you chosen to be in 5D? And are you now a beacon of light? Just like this lighthouse. What choices have you made to serve your life purpose? Hello and welcome to another episode of A Few Minutes with Marvin, where I inspire those who aspire to make positive changes in their lives. And in this video we're going to talk about your mission, your soul mission and your life purpose to be a beacon of light. Just as, like this lighthouse lights a way for the boats to come into shore, are you shining your light, your divine light, as a beacon for other souls to find their light? To be who they were meant to be in this now moment. Stop hiding in the shadows. Stop following the narratives. Stop being so stuck in the 3D life. It's time. Are you up for the challenge? You know what's going on in this world. You see it clearly now if you're on your spiritual path. Now more than ever. You know, with the threats looming of, you know, WW3 or whatever the narrative is out there. I'm not 100% sure what that is. But I have a feeling, you know, everybody's going to be brought to the brink of disaster, destruction, biblical events. And the fear is going to be escalating. All beautiful souls need us now more than ever to be that beacon of light, that lighthouse right? for all other souls who are going to be terrified. They're going to be afraid that they're going to hit that rock on their way to shore because that lighthouse didn't light up the path. We can't allow that to happen like warriors. This is our mission. This is our time to shine. Are you ready? I'm ready. That's what my mission has been for the last year and a half, two years. And I see it so clearly. Do you see it clearly? I'm asking you to start going deeper now. Really, start feeling the energies. And if there's any energies that are not, that's not there for your highest good, learn how to send those energies away but with, with love, not with anger, not with fear, right? Because the more that we do this for ourselves, the more we're going to help other people do it for themselves. And the more we're going to hold the light so that these dark shadows and negative energies don't have the effect on all the other beautiful souls, right? Because that's how they win, keeping people in fear. They control your emotions, they control you. So, as spiritual people on our path, spiritual souls, we can't allow that to happen to us. We're on the front lines, and we need to put on our armor of the Supreme Being, right? To shield and protect all those who can't see it, who are so stuck in this matrix, who are so stuck in their everyday lives, thinking that there's nothing to see here just as they've been told nothing to see here don't look here look over there right it's time for us to put up our shield against these other forces not in anger but in love so that they stop projecting these narratives these fear tactics that are keeping millions of people billions of people in the dark we need to be the light we need to be that lighthouse so, I encourage you to join me. What do you have to do, you say? Share this video. That would certainly help. Wake other people up. Share other videos that are out there that are speaking the truth, right? And how do you know it's the truth? You can feel it, right? 
And only you can discern what the truth is. You don't have to agree with me, and if you don't, that's fine. But if you do, share this message. There are other people like us that need this. You need to hear that we need to be the light. It's our mission. It's our sacrifice for the good of humanity, the good of Mother Gaia, the good of the universe, right? And for the future of all beautiful souls that have yet to come. experience your truth as a light warrior as a beacon of light so join me come aboard I'm right here you know and if you and if you have archangels and angels and ascendant masters that you work with start calling on them to help you shine your light brighter not to shine it for you stand next to them and be that light because they are already the light they're waiting for you and so are millions of other light warriors, rainbow warriors of the Hopi prophecy and chosen ones that are waiting for you to step in to your place online. Put your shield up, hold your light, hold that sword, right? Use it as a light, not as a weapon. Just as this lighthouse uses its beacon as a light to guide others. And that's what we can do. And it is that simple. You just, if you don't believe that, you just have to go a little deeper. That's all. Convince yourself first. You have to do it for you first before you can convince others. And if you can't convince others, that's okay. Still hold your light. They'll get it sooner or later. And those that don't, don't. And it's okay. They're on their path. And there's nothing we can do about that. So, shine your light. Beautiful souls. Be the beacon. Be the lighthouse for others and have an amazing day. And if you're still having trouble seeing your own light, right? So that, you know, if you can't see your light, you can't help others see their light. I can help you. I'm a tra spiritual transformation coach. Here's the link to my website. Give me a, head, uh, a shout. You know, uh, schedule a 30-minute decompression session. Let's let's help you see that light again within yourself, so that you can be that light for others. You deserve it. You are worth it. And you are a light warrior. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Share it. Seriously, share it. We need we need this message to get out to other people. It's going to resonate with other folks. Leave a comment. Let me know where you are on your your uh, spiritual journey, and if you're already shining your your uh, beacon of light brilliantly, I'd love to know. And sub subscribe to my channel. Let's keep this going. Right? There are forces out there that are preventing these videos from going out. The more of us. This that's more of you that subscribe to this channel, it, it really does shift the algorithm so that it can reach more people. Let's do that. This is how we can do it, through our message, through our inspiration, through our voice. So, be the light, be the voice. Thank you for spending a few minutes with me.